Hi, this is Danny Doyle, back with more Fire Emblem for 0% growth, uh, and I just remembered, I mean I didn't just remember, in planning this out I remembered that Zane, who is the first of the uh, Attack of the Clones bosses, has a Horse Slayer, um, which is bad because effective damage in Fire Emblem 4 is just an automatic critical hit, and you saw how powerful the crits were with the Killer Bow. Um, so my initial plan of just sort of like charging up there with a bunch of cavalry, probably not going to fly, but I have an idea. Uh, first off, I am going to repair some weapons. I repaired the Brave Axe already, so I'm going to repair the Killer Bow. And eventually Jamka is going to be selling the Barrier Ring. I haven't decided who it's going to, probably Sigurd, because like everything's got to go to Sigurd. Um, but eventually he'll be selling the Barrier Ring. And do... I'm going to do another patented tactical retreat. And I'm going to have Finn guard the castle because he is Miracle. And my hope is that he can just constantly proc Miracle. Um, well... <sighs> We'll see. Cause the other option is like maybe Holen, when he wakes up, can guard the castle. Like now that I think about it, the Horse Slayer like definitely one shots Finn, a base level Finn. I need to hold this choke point, which I can have someone stand on the tile that Eflin's on in order to do, and I need to hold. Where are you going? Do you? Yeah. Okay. Good. Uh, so I need to hold the castle, and I need to hold the choke point. So I basically need two units who can survive the enemy phase. And... Oh right, she has a talk combo with Sigurd. I was thrown off by that briefly. So I think maybe put Sigurd here, put Holin in the castle maybe, and Finn just like run away like everyone else. Uh, I did also off camera check on love growths and well or not love growths love uh, what love level people are at and while it's not going to be an issue for this chapter because we are at turn number 68 and love stops growing after is it you yeah it's you love stops growing after turn 50 so we're like past the point where it matters. Uh, the positioning of Ideen and Jamka, and probably Ideen Madir as well, is going to be important because I really don't want them to fall in love. I would like Claude to fall in love with Ideen. And I get Claude late next chapter, and it might behoove me to leave Ideen in the castle until then, which, I don't know. Just to like stop the, the love growth that you get from just hanging around. Because I can't really leave Jamka behind. And they only get a couple of points every turn, but it adds up. Part of the reason that they're so high is they have, such, they have a base that's pr uh, pretty significant as well. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh I forgot about these fucks. Oh no, oh, are we gonna have more like green unit shenanigans where I thought they were gonna like, please don't let, please don't kill Aaron. Fuck. Now Aaron's gonna attack them, isn't she? Fuck. No, Aaron, no. Don't kill each other, be friends! I don't know that- Lewin can't reach, can he? Uh, 
Yeah, Lewin can't reach when they're like that, so I should have departed with him last turn. Uh, that's an oopsie-daisy, but it's very easily rectified, just doing the exact same moves, but also, like, having Lewin leave. And I guess I have to leave those Pegasi alive so that the fucking green units don't pull a big old dum-dum. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, much better. Uh, I did the exact same moves other than having Lewin depart the castle. These fucking paladins. I swear to god. Alright, so now he's gonna recruit Aaron. And... Oh, we can skip that. Aaron is gonna, like, fly away. I guess Aaron, like, you could talk about her a little bit. Like, her stats are fine. Uh, I, I forgot, like, how serviceable they were. Um... I mean, serviceable for 0%. Um, the downside of being a flyer in this game is, yes, you still get, like, the super canto that all mounted units get, but you can't take advantage of road tiles, which are, I believe, in the entire series history, the only terrain tile that actually adds movement as opposed to taking it away. So, you basically have the same movement that a footlocked unit would have because most cavalry will gain one to two points of movement every turn but you won't yeah i i did i did rethink um having finn hold that point i think send him back here have sigurd with like a couple of two range guys surrounding him in order to choke it. They haven't moved, have they? I have to bait them, don't I? I mean, that gives me a little bit more time, I guess, to, like, set up. That is obnoxious, though. Okay, well, if we're, if we're just doing a bunch of setup, then, um, I guess I'll do that off-camera. Now that I've got Aaron, I guess I could... No, because there's road tiles. I was going to say, I guess I could bait with her, but there's bow people and road tiles, and... Yeah. Uh, we're we're going to go ahead and do some moving around off-camera. Okay, uh, we've done some moving around, and I have successfully gotten them to start moving with Sigurd, so it's time for a tactical retreat. Uh, you'll notice that I took Finn off the castle and I put Lewin up there. Uh, Lewin needs to be trained anyway, um, so it seems like, you know, why not? Um, if it doesn't work out, I did drop a save at another chapter. I've got Holen Hogan holding this choke point, Sigurd uh, running away. I'm not sure how I'm gonna, like, I want to protect the castle because funds, but also, like, it's just, it'll be good to sort of divide up the attention of the various people attacking, and Lewin can attack at 1-2 range, so... I don't know, fast, avoid bonus, like, it just seems like a good, uh, good choice choice for defending the castle. I might try to pick off some of these people with Sigurd on the way down as well. Let me see if I can, um, because they, they ride in formations, which causes them to make weird movements. Let me see if I can place Sigurd in such a way as to attract a couple of these guys. So if I put him like here or here, I could get a couple of, if not kills, at least some damage. Yeah. With the silver sword, cause you know, uh, either I damage them and make them easier to kill later, or I get some more Silver Sword kills that I wouldn't have otherwise. I do plan on just sort of stomping through these Armor Knights with Sigurd and probably like Ethlin for healing purposes. Like the main, the once I get past Zane and his obnoxious Rider's Bane, that's sort of the chapter. I, I mean, killing Chigal is going to be just a matter of, um, he's a baron on a castle. You kill a lot of those in FE4. 
they get more and more obnoxious as the game goes forward, and I mean, Chigal personality-wise is very fucking obnoxious, so it would make sense. Like, ludonarrative consonants or whatever. Um, but I feel like I can deal with barons on castles at this point in the game. They're, they're gonna get harder, so if I, they're only gonna get harder from here, so if I can't, you know, that's a, that's a problem for a lot of reasons. Also, I don't know that Zane can, yeah, he can't, uh, he can reach, but, uh, so now I just run away with Sigurd. Ooh, uh, it's a little awkward. I don't know if I can, hmm. That might have been a mistake. Oh, no, because Ethlyn can go up there and heal him. Okay, yeah, no, this is fine. And then heal, and then she'll, like, run away a little bit. Staff, men, do 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 She'll run away a little bit. Um, Sigurd will get at least that bottommost one, like, can get there following road tiles. And then they'll hide behind enemy lines. Let's move Madir just in case. Like, it is a little bit crowded here. I wanted to have options in terms of, like, swapping Holen out and, like, the Kanto units seem good. Maybe I'll get an opportunity for Dude to steal some stuff. He only needs 2,000 more gold to use the bargain band to buy, or to use the bargain skill to buy Ethan's Light Brand, which is something I'm considering because having 1 2 range will make it a lot easier for him to safely see, steal. I'm also going to move Aaron up here. She doesn't fare well against the bows, but I can, like, do a bunch of hit and run stuff potentially. I don't know. We'll see. It's possible that this is all just, like, not going to go nearly as smoothly as I think. I love how they just like move around her <laughs> when they have nothing to do. They're like, well, let's change places. That was supposed to be the Mad Hatter, but it kind of just sounded like a stereotypical old person. Oh, no, they're, they got healing AI on. <laughs> They've got healing AI on. Jesus. He, uh, he's running away to get healed by, uh, there's a, there's a Valkyrie up there. Oh, I guess I should have, since I was doing stuff off camera anyway, I think Ethlyn, like, upon healing, got to promotion. So I, or got to, like, level 20, so she's available for promotion. So I should have just promoted her for the extra movement range and extra magic. But, um, that, I would have done that if I was a good player, but I'm a bad player. I'm fucking terrible at Fire Emblem. <laughs> Uh, I think that's been thoroughly demonstrated by now to be true. Do you... Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, um, I think initially hold the way with Holen because it looks like, like Zane's gonna be one of the next people. Have F1 heal. Or... There we go. Use road tiles. I, I'm bad at Fire Emblem, but I'm learning. At least. Yeah, I'll have Holden hold initially. Um, it might actually be a bad idea to have Azel there because of how squishy he is. Maybe Madeer. Because I think some of them have jabs. And there's like the bow guys as well. So yeah, maybe... Move Azel. Like, the idea was I wanted to be able to take pot shots. But I think just having Sigurd go here and then. Let's see. Oh, they decided to uh, stay in the same place. Okay, okay. Uh, March of the Calves. Come on. Charge, charge, charge. Yes, yes, yes. This is, uh... When people say FE4 isn't a tedious game. Poland getting experience is also good because if I can get him promoted before the end, or before the start of the next chapter. Like, just extra combat stats. He's one of my better combat units.
Ooh. Going for Luin, I see. What rampage? I've just been sitting on this castle. Oh. Oh my. That was a lot of damage, but also, I just hit him down. Uh, let's set a separate save for this, because I got the critical, which is good. But that was a lot of damage, which is bad. Can Sigurd reach? So I can get this kill with Sigurd, but then I'm facing a lot on enemy phase. But I can maybe try to like divide some attention with Nadir. I also got the Horse Slayer. Maybe I'll just... Well, no, I want the Silver Sword. Like, the whole point of getting kills with Sigurd is for the Silver Sword. But... And yeah, it lowers the avoid. Let's not do that, then. Okay, so none of those guys can reach down here. So we'll go ahead and... Attack with the Iron Blade. Oh, nice Luna, Luna, Luna. Now, some of those guys could potentially reach Luin. So I think what I'll end up doing is depart, stick them like here, heal up. Send him back down. The one sort of, and I, I think I've mentioned this gripe as well. Uh, let's also maybe bait some of that. Like, people fucking love attacking Medeer. So maybe we can bait some of them into attacking her or him while he's on the castle. And if that doesn't work, I'll try this same like series of movements again, but with Janka on the castle. And put Eren not there. Uh, put Eren here so that I'm out of bow range, but can potentially do some like hit and run stuff. Move up. Actually, let's like just move Lex here. Like try to get some, try to bait some people with my, uh, my beefy boys. Um, let's... Yeah, quit the jav. And why not just, like, put Finn here, like, the, the... Yeah. Just hold the choke point. Or kind of... It's not... Not hold the choke point yet, but, like, I'm preparing to hold the choke point. I'm just sort of rambling. Um... Let's see what happens. Okay. Bow guys are going for Holen. Interesting choice. Uh, that's no good. Ooh! I mean, he's got Weapon Triangle against the Axe guys, but I think the Lance guys can... Interesting. Well, I mean... Okay. And that guy blocked... Okay, so no one else can... Oh, but now I have to kill him in order to get Madeira off there. Oh, that's no good. That's no good at all. Uh, dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay. Luna? 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 No Luna. Okay. That's fine. Um, okay. Okay, but the Lance guy can reach, and he cannot dodge that. I really am adult, aren't I? We will be right back. Okay, uh, slightly different layout, 
than last time. Jamka is in the place where Madeira was. And Quan here. He's got the silver lanes instead of the javelin. I put Holen up here to hopefully bait some things, maybe. Um, and Ira is here to try to kind of divide attention away from Luin. I used Luin to kill the guy here instead of Holen. Um, let's see what happens. Let's see. I mean, we, we know what happens during green, or we kind of know what happens during green unit phase. Sometimes they switch places, sometimes they don't. Okay, so bow guy attacking Lewin. Ooh, nice dodge. Ooh, nice adapt too. That's good, that's very good. A little bit of chip on Holland, but like he's one of my tankier dudes too. So it's not like, I mean, I say that, but he was the most recent one to die. And this group is just like, Kanto is so good until it's used against you. <laughs> I mean, it's still good then. It's just like, it's good for the people using it. Okay. Uh, I think this is the same guy who attacked Madeir and then ended up, like, not being able to move off the castle. Yeah, so... That means Jamka's safe from one range, which likely means no one else is going to attack him. Um, I mean, the Bow Knights might surprise me, but... Okay, uh... Weapon Triangle? No dodge, okay. Uh, I think the... I think those two closest bows, like the bows have all moved, maybe? And if that's the case, then he's gonna, um, oh, Lex taking a lot more damage than I thought he would. I guess I'm used to Great Knight being like a mounted armor knight, as opposed to just being promoted axe unit who only gets access to axes. Okay, on the upside, he has Vantage, and he is one-routing these guys, so, I mean, we're just gonna get a bunch of kills on the Brave Axe. That's good, right? Chop. Chop. Yeah, so Lex is safe. I just hope that... So, like, the only way I can... Like, something could... I was just about to say if someone attacks Sigurd instead, then he gets boxed in. And the game confirmed my worst fears. At least, like, I mean, it's fucking so good, Lex. So good, Lex. This is why Pursuit, or not Pursuit, this is why Vantage is just like, I love when you can rely on Vantage. I don't like, I think it's, we were actually just talking about this, uh, a couple people, I was talking to a couple of friends about this, um, how in FE10, <laughs> Vantage is so bad because you just can't rely on it. Um, yes, I want to save, this is a very good layout. Uh, well, very good might be a bit of an exaggeration, but it's a good one. Uh, let's kill that guy with the killer bow, maybe? Maybe. Not quite. That's okay. Um, Holen. Run away and retreat. Uh, so we have Sylvia here so that we can, like, Saf, Men, da 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 da. Potentially get a three person dance in that square. I mean, four if I want, if I was able to do something with Aaron. Like, I could fly her here. Like, I, I could... I can't do anything with her, because she just has the slim lance. And, like, by that, when going here, I want to be able to, like, canto back over. Um, now the question is, who do I... I guess I could... Okay, Finn has eight movement. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He should be able to, with the road tiles, because he's just traveling over... Well, okay, so two of those are plain. Um, not sure if he can make it back, actually. Like, to where I want him. Yeah, I can't quite. Okay. That's fine. 
He did a good job. Get a kill with Madeir. Madeir, I'll be able to dance for Madeir. That's what it'll be. There we go. And then dance. And I believe planting Arden here is another like one tile wide choke point because Cliff, Cliff, yeah. So I can just put Arden here. Put Luin. It's like dodgy, but also not the most reliable. Um, Silver Lance is going to, okay. Um, like I want to get Sigurd out of here. I think. Oh, I can't move with, oh, okay. Okay, so I think Silver Sword. Oh no, no, wrong guy. I wanted to kill the. Oh, okay, that works then. Um, I'll still put Sigurd there. Um, I'll attack Bravely. Yeah, I'll kill that guy then. Lex is gonna have to take. At least, like, I can't, I don't think I can do anything about that one bow guy. So I can just put him here. Um. Iron blade. Yeah, do the iron blade there. Ah, uh, no Astra. No. Womp womp. Okay. Uh, okay, 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 okay. And then... Luan can survive, like, because there's a bunch. There are a bunch of slim sword Valkyries, right? So their attacks fourteen. Not great, TBH. But it's just you know it's the way it's got to be. How much is these guys? They're so that guy's at full. Um, what does this guy deal to, or what does Quan deal to her? Thirty-six. Okay, so I can get. Well, I mean, I guess it makes slightly more sense to try to get a kill on Madeir. Well, what's the Silver Lances? Yeah, two. Okay, so I don't think Madeir's promoting, but it is smart to. Well, I'm feast. I'm healing now. Yeah, it'll be fine. Um. I face retaliation, but I'm gonna be healing. So we will just go back over here. Uh, have Madeir, Steel Bow, that guy. Maybe block off Lewin. Um, where is this guy? Okay, so I can put Aaron like here and be safe. Colin. Heal up Quan. Start moving these guys forward. Well, and especially now that I have two mages, Baron on a castle isn't going to be as big of a deal. I almost don't want to even move the Christmas calves, but like options. I like having options. Um, yeah, I like having options. Okay, so he's attacking Ira. 
which means Madeir faces at most the sing- oh! <laughs> Fucking FE4 AI. There we go, that's another silver sword kill. Nice. Oh no, three damage. I might be able to steal some money with Dew. Chop. Chop. What did the Valkyries even deal to do? Like, if I get rid of the other threats, I could just, like, steal some money with Dew for both of them. They don't two-shot him. Oh, come on. Dude, you are just the worst thief. You can't steal jack shit. There we go. Ooh, dodgy, though. Heal up, because they will three-shot him. And let's, uh, let's just start heading forward. I'm gonna probably be, like I said, stomping through these guys with Sigurd and the Silver Sword. 31, okay. 31, okay. Come on, trigger adept. Adept? No adepts. Womp womp. Okay, uh, Holin, where you at? You're 14, okay. So overall, uh, did not go quite as planned, but I still think things turned out pretty darn good. Um, have Aaron do that. Uh, Aaron waiting next to Sylvia is dangerous. <laughs> if you do it in chapter four, sometimes Sylvia will just like accidentally fall in love with uh, Lewin. It's stupid how easy it is for Lewin to accidentally fall in love with Sylvia. And then you can, like, on purpose fall in love with Eren super easy as well. Like, they have a single talk combo that just automatically makes them fall in love if they aren't already. Uh, yeah, that's that, that's that for now. I think, uh, these two Valkyries, like, they're not gonna they're not gonna combine to kill anyone. And they're likely to just target Dew, right? And let him steal the, the other one's gold. Uh, well, or target Chamka. That's also an appropriate uh, thing for them to do. I am tempted to see if I can abuse their, like, desire to heal each other. To level do up to 20, but like, holy shit, would that take a long time? Is this the that's the zero gold one? And I don't know that rogue promotions are worth it. Um, especially considering that I'd be spending healing staff uses every turn every time he got hit. There we go. And let's just finish cleanup duty. Adept? No adept. Womp womp. Oh well. Um, do survives a hit. Aaron survives a hit. 
You can choose who you want to kill you. Let's see who she decides she wants to kill her before finishing up for today. Oh, you chose a green unit. <laughs> uh, please don't, please, please don't be charging the armor knights now. Please don't be charging the armor knights now. Christ. These green units are going to be the fucking death of me. Um, make my struggles worth all of it. Like, comment, and subscribe, please. Bye bye.